good morning assalamu alaikum uh, today we'll continue our ecg course and today we'll uh, speak about introduction for arrhythmia and we'll speak about arrhythmia classification my name is ahmed al hadidi i am emergency medicine consultant arrhythmia is abnormal uh, heart rhythm it may be too slow or too quick or irregular it can be classified according to the origin of the rhythm itself from the heart so rhythms uh, uh, originating from SA node, say no atrial node, and rhythms originating from the atrium, any part in the atria except the SA node, rhythm originated from originating from the AV node, and at the last rhythms originating from the ventricle itself. Uh, first rhythms originating from the sino atrial node has two important characteristics. First one, B wave precede HQRS complex with regular PR interval. So before HQRS, there is normally a normal shape B wave with normal BR or regular BR interval. And second characteristic is the B wave axis falls between zero and plus 90 degree. So this means B wave is positive in lead two and inverted B wave in lead AVR. So in lead two, B wave must be positive. Uh, rhythms originating from the SA node, like normal sinus rhythm, sinus tachycardia, sinus bradycardia, sinus arrhythmia, and sinus bows, which actually is stoppage of the sinus rhythm, or sinus arrest, which uh, absence of sinus rhythm uh, uh, actually. Uh, second uh, classification is rhythms originating from the atria, anywhere in the atria except the SA node. Uh, B wave usually has abnormal contour, so it might be negative, it might be abnormal shape, abnormal axis, and uh, uh, QRS complexes are of normal configuration, so it's narrow QRS complex, not wide QRS complex, except if there is apparent conduction, it will be wide QRS, but uh, uh, the usual rhythm for the rhythm originating from the atria is uh, narrow complex tachycardia. Uh, uh, example for or, or rhythms originating from the atria like premature atrial contractions, wandering atrial pacemaker, atrial tachycardia, multifocal atrial tachycardia, atrial fibrillation, supraventricular tachycardia, and atrial flutter. And we will discuss all of these rhythms in separate presentations, and uh, 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 each one uh, separately. Uh, third uh, classification is uh, rhythms originating from the AV node itself, and nodal rhythm is characterized by usually B wave absent or inverted and even can, may come after the QRS complex. So this is the B wave, this is the B wave, this is the B wave with narrow complex. These are uh, uh, junctional uh, tachycardia or nodal tachycardia. QRS complex is usually normal in duration and configuration because usually every nodal uh, rhythm, this uh, distributes the uh, electrical activity to right bundle branch and left bundle branch in the same time. But uh, the character here, the most important thing is that B wave might be absent at all, might be negative, or even can come after the QRS complex. Uh, like nodal premature beats, uh, junctional or nodal escape beats and accelerated nodal or junctional rhythm and uh, nodal or junctional tachycardia. Uh, for definition of junctional rhythm, it depends according to uh, the heart rate. So junctional rhythm with rate below 40, this is junctional bradycardia. Junctional uh, rhythm with a rate between 40 and 60 beat, this is junctional escape rhythm. Junctional rhythm with rate between 60 and 100, this is accelerated junctional rhythm. And junctional rhythm more than 100 beat per minute, this is junctional tachycardia. Uh, at the end, rhythm originating from the ventricle itself, uh, this is the fourth classification is characterized uh, by bizarre or white QRS complexes and T-wave 
pointing in direction opposite to uh, QRS complex. So ventricular rhythm or uh, rhythm originating from the ventricle, usually when the, the rhythm is or the QRS is mainly negative, T wave will be positive, and when QRS is positive, T wave will be negative, and this is called discordance. QRS complexes randomly related to B wave if visible. So here we cannot see any B wave, but here there is B wave here, here, and here. And QRS complexes, this is ventricular escape rhythm associated with complete heart block. So B wave has no relation at all to QRS complexes. Uh, rhythms originating from the ventricle, like premature ventricular contraction, ventricular escape rhythm, accelerated idioventricular rhythm, and ventricular tachycardia, and polymorphic ventricular tachycardia, and ventricular flutter, and of course, as a, a part of cardiac arrest rhythm, ventricular fibrillation. Uh, uh, thank you so much, and please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.